Did you? What yeah, me? exactly. Okay, so now we're incorporating the e-collar. And now, whenever you say break, you're going to tap the button. Just the same time. And then good. Well done. Well done. So now walk around and then put them in place again. Now, when you say place, you're also tapping the button, okay? So he's getting like, so he's now not shying. He's not yeah. trying to stick with dad. He's not, what dad's making it mean is just, this means pay attention. Yeah. So the, right now the e is only ever meant. Now this time, don't say break. I want you just to tap the button or, or hold. Yeah, now say break as he's coming. And then good. Well done. Well done. So you're making it, you're incorporating it and layering it all to mean the same thing. Yeah. So basically what you want the collar to mean is pay attention. Then, because over time he's going to be able to go pop, heel, yep. pop, on you go, pop, come back, pop, place. But the pop is just to get the attention. And now you're working on distance and duration. Beautiful. See how far you can go. The worst he's going to do is break it. And if he, if he beats you to it and starts running, just tap it and say break, okay? Beautiful. And then it's just associating anyway. Yeah. But look at how much relationship there's there. Do yeah, you know what I mean? That's good. Yeah. So that's proper training right there. Nice. So this is why you should be consistent with name, command, mark. Rab, come, good. Rab, place, good. Okay. Rab, break. When I'm breaking him, I might be like a good boy, yes. Okay, it's a different type of marker. We'll talk more about that, but this is what you want. And then say, for example, right now you're doing this and then that dog next door starts barking, right? By this positive only trainer nonsense. You would, um, he might react a bit and you go, no bother. Just stand where you were, hold the button and turn the dial until you, and you'll see him, you'll go, habit, whoa, 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 whoa. And you're like, yeah, good job. Yeah. Two days he won't bark, at the, he won't react at all. If, they, if those dogs say that's a good distraction, nice. So if, if that started to bark, right now my guys wouldn't even acknowledge, they wouldn't even, they wouldn't even care. It's not their job. And what we're trying to teach him and her, ignore that. Who cares about that? Ignore the sheep. Ignore the, ignore the person. Ignore the dog. Ignore, this is what our pack's doing. Yeah. So I mean, what a great bonding experience he's doing with him here. And you learn to love the dog more because he's actually listening to you. Yeah. But it's, yeah, that was a really good one. Did you see it? So people that go, you know, e-collar training, whatever, is lazy, it's barbaric, it's no. the past. It's the most modern way of training a dog. We didn't have that option 40 years ago. Do you know what I mean? Now, what he could have done there is when he got up and he didn't want him to, he could have tapped him and went, no. Yeah. And start adding in basically a consequence. Okay. The dog's very smart, so we go on nowadays about how dogs are so smart. Yeah, that was good. So he, it was literally as he was releasing the button, yeah. you saw the dog move about half second before he said come. Yeah. That's what I'm wanting. Yeah. Until he knows the collar. Now when he fully then knows the collar, you'll be able to mix up. Sometimes you use collar, sometimes you'll be vocal first, sometimes you'll be e-collar first. But when you're teaching the way I teach, it's always e-collar then vocal. And then you're knowing that he's responding to the collar yeah. and understanding it. It's called the conditioning phase. And look how in tune he is. Do you know what I mean? So like Rab's further on than dad. Yeah. Like he needed Rab come good there. Yeah. And dad went, Rab, uh, good boy. <laughs> and that's okay. That's just part of the learning. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're, you're being very quick. But doesn't the e-collar help you, speeds you up so much? And that's with distractions of dogs around. Good, now say place. Yeah, you can say your stays and all that as well, but add in place, because over time you want to just say place and it means all of that. Yeah. And there'll be mistakes, that's like the piano lessons, missing a key, that's okay. Nice. I like that you tapped in there, that was good. Just to calm it back down. Rex, go and get a drink, for goodness sake. Stay here, you're like a train there.